After a 10-year civil war that tore the country apart, a grassroots organization is working to rebuild the lives of the people in Sierra Leone. The local chapter of Worldwide Opportunities on Organic Farms, known as WOOF, trains farmers in organic agriculture practices. Foreign travelers work as volunteers alongside the locals. All my people are farmers, so I try to link myself with Wolf organization and see how we can uh, we can work together and uh, bring experience, or pass our own local experience to international uh, uh, volunteers. Wolf was an organization that was recommended to me. Uh, they accommodate you in exchange for your work, um, which is great. You know, I like to work hard. I have no problem doing that. And I get to live in a different country, you know, and someone's going to feed me and give me a place to sleep at night. When people come from abroad, instead of just traveling, uh, they come and share experience. We place them, we look at farmers as a host families. And then that cultural understanding, they, they share the culture, their own culture. You have to be kind of careful about uh, you know, the do's and don'ts, because we're in a completely different world here. We don't really know what's acceptable and what's not, you know. Even if you're not hungry, you eat, you know. If they offer it to you, you eat. I think I'm going to look back on this and I believe I'm going to, you know, tell myself this was one of the most important stages of my life, I think. Besides working with international volunteers, Woof Sierra Leone helps local farmers develop their knowledge of organic farming, which helps improve the farmer's rate of success. They're also provided with tools and seedlings. The surplus food is then sold for extra income. They can do it for themselves, but they do it on a subsistence uh, basis, you see, and that is not what we want them to, to do. So we want them to be able to have profits from what they do, the labor that they do.